Hello there guys, it's Peter X with the next episode of Let's Play Paper Mario Blind. In today's episode I am going to visit Sheik. Now with the lemon, because he likes lemon for some reason. So yeah, now we're going to him right there. He's a mouser. Yes, the thing is nice, yes, very nice. Nice guy, get all nice stuff. I give him something. Lemon. Oh, heavenly lemon. The nicest of nice things. You are proving your nice by giving me my favorite thing. And since you're so nice, yes, I'll tell you something really nice. How to see Mustafa? To find Mr. Mustafa, go to the shop in the town. First, buy a dry room, then buy a dusty hammer. You must buy them in the correct order, yes? Remember, dry room first, and then dusty hammer. It's a secret sign now to those loyal to Mustafa. If you buy these things in the correct order, the owner of the shop will let you see Mr. Mustafa. Remember, you must not buy them in the incorrect order. First, try right, mushroom, then broken hammer. That's the order you should buy them in. Not try right, mushroom and broken hammer, but in the correct order. If you still seek knowledge, you must give me something more. Yes, you understand? Well, this is enough. Well, goodbye. I wish you luck in fighting Mr. Mustafa, nice guy. He's creepy. And his voice is creepy. I get creeped out by doing that creepy voice. Let's see, I have to sell something. So I have to move for. Let's go sell it and I can sell this. I sell you a Goomba nut. Goom nut. Yes, I will sell the Goom nut to you. Now I buy dry room first. And then I try the dusty hammer. Something happened. What? Oh, buying a dusty hammer on a dry tomb is a secret sign that only friends of Mr. Mustafa know. That means you are with Mustafa. Hey, brother, good to meet you. Have you questions you need answered? You want to see Mr. Mustafa? It's usually up in the highest part of dry dry outpost. Just keep going up, my man. Oh, no. Oh no, not the desert again. Everything but not the desert. <laughs> Wait, this is the. Oh. Yeah, this is right our outpost. I was worried that I would have to. I was worried that I would have to go through the desert again. I really hope I don't have to. No, this is not the guy I look for. Is this the guy I look for? Oh, yeah, it's like this guy. I'm going to see him. Huh? 
I think a special course because those are the best ones. This is oh, but this was the wrong guy. I wonder what would happen. What the fuck did happen? A thing of ice power in my fist froze to cover. It will light your darkest hour. Even should you meet a beast, not to fear, not in the least. My spell makes a family feast. See you then. This guy reminds me of Sakura. For everyone who watched Mild Pony Friendship is Magic, they should know who Sakura is. But for everyone else, well, it's the witchcraft. Unicorn. No, not unicorn. Ze zebra. It's a zebra. A zebra. Yeah, zebras are somewhat like the unicorns, but still not. Unicorns are more focused on. Well, should I say real magic, but as there is no real magic. And a fake magic in the world of my bone fresh, but he is more focused on nat natural magic as you. Zebras are more focused on natural magic. You could see them as a shaman and unicorns, more like wizards. Yeah, you get it. You get the difference. Hey, nice guy. We meet again. I'm glad you f found me. <gasps> The desert, everything but not the desert. Back to the desert, yes. No. The pulse stones flash above your head as you get close to the ruins. As you get to the ruins, the faster the pulse stone will flash, follow where it leads you. Find the place where the pulse stone flashes the fastest and use it to open the way. Why cruel world? Why do I have to go to the desert again? <laughs> I did never want to see that place again. It's the worst place I've ever been in any video game ever. Nice, it starts blinking. So, yeah, back now. I'm not gonna cry anymore because I had to go to the desert. Hopefully. But I hate the desert with an undying passion. The passion of Christ. But it's a bad passion, not a good passion. So oh, now we are on our way to the next temple or well whatever. I call them temples because Whoa. I have never been I 
have never been this happy in my entire life. He killed the enemy I had problems with. Hopefully of this I will never have to go to the desert again. For some reason I think I could go up here. But first, I'm going to... Oh, a tornado. I really don't want to I cross out the dry tree. So, closer. This desert is as annoying as I say it is. Anyone else who has played this game you can judge the desert. I myself find the desert. Yeah, you have heard my opinion about it already over 9,000 times, but I hate the desert so much. All these enemies, all this lunking around trying to find me. I might hate it this much because of I have, because I have spent a ton of episodes just in it. happen now it became night Explorers are all afraid, and the townsfolk are all afraid, and most of I just sit there laughing this creepy laugh, as all he does is creepy. I really find that Mustafa he guy creepy. I mean, he has double identity and everything that 
creepy. I wonder where... Oh. It would be nice now, though, that I am finally kinda out of the desert. I mean, a... king of the desert. Who dares to through the death in my palace of sands? Speak and be known. Be gone from this past place now, or disaster will befall you. I will explore this place in the next episode. Have a nice day and see you tomorrow when I will do the next episode of this let's play. Good. Bye.